From the president of production at Paramount Pictures to becoming the first woman president of a major studio, Columbia Pictures, these are just some of the hit films Dawn Steele has been involved with. Famous for her big hair and short temper, many Hollywood insiders say Dawn Steele ruled Columbia Pictures with one of the meanest mouths Hollywood has ever seen or heard. Others say she got a bum rap because she was just as tough and smart as the men she worked with. Either way, Steele was pushed out as president of Columbia in 1991. The question is, can a man do it all and be liked? Mm -hmm. Do you know, I think that's a really great question. And when people say to me, you know, what about those, those words, you know, they call you tough or they call you aggressive, and, and I say, well, I don't think those are bad words. Do you know, and the fact of the matter is, is if some people think those are bad words, it's their problem. Steele, who was in town for a Sunbank-sponsored speaking engagement, recently released her first book, creatively titled, They Can Kill You, But They Can't Eat You. My point was to speak out to other women coming up the ladder, to try to convey to them some of the lessons that I learned, to help them not make some of the same mistakes I made. Despite befriending some of Hollywood's biggest stars, this woman of Steele says Hollywood was and still is a man's world. To run Columbia Pictures, I had to be as tough a manager as any man had to be running another motion picture studio. A self-admitted movie nut, Steele is now a mom and an independent producer for Disney, most recently producing this new hit comedy, Cool Runnings. Are you glad you're out of it? Oh, am I glad I'm out of this? I'm so glad I can't tell you how glad. When you're running a studio, most of what you're doing is really not about making the movies. It's about making the deals and making the business of the business work. So I'm very happy I'm out of it and I'm able to make the movies myself now. Lisa Petrillo, Channel 10 Eyewitness News, Daybreak.